The idea behind the program is to increase the instructional capacity within the normal school day within the classroom to get students to believe that they can before they believe that they can't. I got to work one-on-one -on -one with um, two first graders. I went in two, uh, two days a week for an hour and um, worked with him mostly on language arts. And um, I'm supposed to be there for an hour, but I normally am there a little longer. And so then every time when I went in, he like, got excited, but like, he like, couldn't tell, like, let me see that he was excited. It was like when the other kids would be like, hey, she's here, I'd be like, yes. But then as soon as you come over, are we going to read? Yes, we're going to read. Like my roommate is in it as well. And we would come home from school and like talk about our kids and how well they had done that day. For me, it also, it's, you know, it's affirmed that, you know, teaching, this is what I want to do. I want to be a teacher. I want to help kids who need it. I don't even think I missed a day because I knew how important that was. The CHIEF program benefits the kids in every aspect of their life. If we didn't have the achieve. I don't. I really don't think that um, some of my students would have made the growth that they made this year. As the year progressed, I really saw a bigger gain in those three children that I was sending with the achieve tutors. And so, twice a week, having all of those students from MU walk through our doors and work one on one or two on one with kids has been phenomenal. So I think everybody should have this experience. It just cemented that I want to be a teacher and that I really want to work with students in need. It's, it's been really transformational. I remember calling home and telling my mom, there's this program and I really want to get involved. She's like, oh, that sounds right up your alley. You're going to love it. But I had no idea, like, the effect it would ha have on me. Because we get, to, we get to feel, like, the pride of helping. I guess maybe not pride, but just, I don't know, goodwill <laughs> of helping a kid grow. You know, we've made a connection, we've made a bond, and knowing, knowing that he looks forward to me showing up and knowing that I look forward to going, it's, that's, that's been the best part. Everybody should have a one-on-one -on -one experience with a child like that. She can definitely um, achieve a lot, which is interesting because it is called the Achieve Program. Like, I would explain it to people at work who are non-education majors and they were like wow that's really cool I wish I would have you know had a chance to do that even though I'm not you know into the whole teaching thing that would have been really cool just to be able to kind of help kids. I did have one little boy he just was like I cannot write and so by the end of all of this I mean he's just writing sentence after sentence after sentence and I mean that was definitely all thanks to the tutor. I think it was a great benefit for my kids um, it was a perfect match that I couldn't have asked for any better MU students, they were just phenomenal, willing to do whatever needed to be done, just jumped right in. I had one student who I saw an incredible difference with. Uh, she was a student who lost her mother at a very young age, and it is amazing the transformation of this child. Uh, it almost brings tears to my eyes to know that that's all she needed. She just needed someone to say, hey, listen, I'm going to spend just time with just you. Well, I think uh, significant growth was having that consistency, that they could count on someone coming and being here with them. As soon as those girls walked into the door, they knew to stand up and get their bucket of books and to get their journal out of their box and get started on those consistent routines that we had going. That will affect their whole life, their, what job they get, what they can do in their life if they can read and, and write and, and be able to communicate with people. So. I think it's a great program to have the ACHIEVE program. Uh, the talk in the teacher's lounge, whenever we would talk about the ACHIEVE program, how um, I would hear stories of how wonderful the MU students were and how everyone really appreciated their help. So it gave them that one-on-one -on -one support that they really needed if they weren't exactly where they were supposed to be. You could definitely see big changes from like the beginning to the end of the year. He loves reading now, where at the beginning he didn't. Physically, emotionally, mentally, just in every way. It was really, really cool to see them progress. Now she's proactive, so I don't have to always say like, what's due tomorrow? It's kind of like, oh, well I have to do such and such, but I'll do this at home, I'll do this now. So she's starting to think even more of when should I do things. You can teach them fractions. You can teach them, you know, paragraph form. 
but um, in order to do really anything, you have to have the confidence to do it. And there were words that he definitely couldn't spell or even like begin to sound out at the beginning of the year. And today he was spelling them perfectly. He was helping other kids in his class spell words. This has been the richest experience of uh, my time here so far at MU and I, I think any, anyone who has the opportunity to be a part of would be missing out if they didn't. This past week telling him that I was leaving, he was like, oh, well, you're coming to second grade with me, right? And I had to tell him, well, no, you're doing such a good job, you could get to go to second grade and I won't be there next year. So that was kind of hard, but it stuck with me. You could see the impact that they were having on the, the students and it was a huge impact. And I think just like I said before, it makes a big difference that those girls came consistently and every week. And that is so important, especially with this age group. He smiled so much larger every time his person came with him and he became to where he shared more with her willingly. Tutors that I had were very professional, always on time. Um, if they weren't going to be here, if they were sick, they always sent me an email. Um, I think they were exceptional and in hindsight they, they just really had a lot of, they would just step in and do, I wouldn't have to tell them and give them lots of instruction. So they really could just take it on their own and do what they needed to do. It's just that extra um, mentor and feeling of someone coming in just special for them has been really beneficial to our students. We had a huge success with the program so I mean I think it's really important and I hope that we can do it again. Um, it just it was really really great. They were awesome. They were positive and fun and the kids look forward to seeing them. I would do it again. I loved it. That same little boy, he at the beginning of the year was not on level, not where he needed to be reading and that extra time and that routine, that consistency that I'm talking about, he is where he needs to be. It helped my kids a lot so yes, if, if I got the opportunity to have Achieve Tutors again, I would certainly say yes.